What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video, we're drawing Opila Bird from the Garden of Ban Ban. Let's begin today's lesson at the top right side of our page and draw two circles for the eyes. Let's start with the one on the left. Let's start from the very top, come all the way around towards the bottom of the eye, and then bring that back up towards the top. Now we want to leave a small gap in between the eyes and draw the same size circle on the right. So we start by lining up the top of that circle, come in, go all the way around, and then back up. Now we draw a smaller circle in the center of each eye. Start from the top. Want to leave an even space gap all the way around. And we'll draw a small highlight circle on the top left side of each pupil. So bring this in and then back out. Let's fill the bottom of the pupils in black and we'll go around that highlight. Now with the eyes in place, let's draw the beak angled out towards the right. We'll start right in the middle, curve the beak going out in towards the right eye, come down and just hook that back in. Let's go back up to the top, come around the left side, round this out. Now I just want to pull this around and then down towards the tip of the beak. Let's move out to the side and draw on the head. We're going to go all the way up in the middle towards the top of the head, curve around the eye, Come down. I'm just going to bend that in towards the beak. Let's go back up to the top, go around the right side, go around the eye, and then we'll bend that back in. Let's add three hairs along the top of the head. We start right in the middle, start by bending this out towards the left, go up and over towards the right, tape this around and back down towards the center. Now we're going to add two more over towards the right side. Starting back in the middle, go up and out. And then we'll taper that back in. Let's add one more. Going up and down. And then we'll bring that back in. Now we're going to go over towards the left side, underneath the head, and draw on the back of the neck. Curve this around and then back out. Let's overlap the back on top of the neck. So we're going to step in, curve this up, come around, and then down. Let's move over underneath the head on the right, curve the front of the neck going out, come down, and then just bend that in. Now you want to round out the back and make our way back over towards the right side. Come around, and then just bend that in. Let's add the tail on the back, going up, and bend that down. Round up the end of the tail. And I just want to taper the back in towards the back. Now I want to place the wing on top of the body. Let's start on the bottom left, curl the wing going up, and bend that in. Let's round up the front of the wing, come around, and then down towards the bottom. Now I'm going to bend this back up and then down towards the left side. So go across and up, and we'll bend that back down. Now I'm going to place the legs in a walking pose along the bottom. Let's start right in the center, bend the leg coming out, and then down towards the ankle. Let's move over towards the left and draw that same curve. Now I'm going to draw a toe along the back, going around, round up the toe, and then just pull it back in. And we'll draw three toes along the front. Coming around and then down. Let's round up the toe and then we'll bend that back in. Let's layer two more toes in behind. Starting from the end, go around and bend that in. Let's do that one more time, going all the way around and then in towards the ankle. Let's move over and draw on the right leg. We move over, bend this out, and then down towards the ankle. 
And we want to draw that same toe. Coming in, around, and then out. Let's draw the three toes just like we did on the left side. Starting with the front toe, coming down, round up the toe, and then bend that back in. Let's add two more toes in behind. And add the third toe coming in towards the ankle. And we'll bend this back up underneath the body. And then we'll finish off by signing our art and adding a splash of color. And that's pretty much it. That's how we draw the Opila bird from the Garden of Ban Ban. If you enjoyed today's tutorial, then please give this video a like and share it with all your friends. And if you want to keep drawing with me, you might want to check out this video over here. I want to thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon.